The biggest mistake that you can make is underestimating a narcissist. They're masters of manipulation, weaving lies and launching verbal assaults that cut deep. At first glance, they may dazzle you with their charm, but beneath that facade lies a self-absorbed individual hungry for adoration. You're gonna have to play my little game if you want to save one of them. Peel back the layers and you'll find their true nature, one brimming with entitlement and a sense of superiority. Deny them what they desire, and their true colors emerge, ablaze with fury. Now, let's delve into the seven things that strike at the core of a narcissist's being. First, narcissists hate the word, no. Narcissists absolutely despise hearing the word no. They firmly believe that their desires and feelings come first, no matter what. Picture this. You're dating someone who has certain expectations for you, like wearing specific clothes or joining them in activities. But when you decline, stating your own preferences, they react with anger. Narcissists can't handle rejection, so they'll do anything to sway you, even resorting to manipulation or force. Saying no challenges their sense of control and superiority, triggering their defensive response. It's like their world is rocked when they don't get their way. They'll argue, guilt trip, or throw tantrums to get you to comply. The idea of not getting what they want is unbearable to them. In their minds, it's all about winning and being in charge. They refuse to accept that others have boundaries or autonomy. So, when faced with refusal, they lash out to regain power. It's a relentless cycle of demanding and reacting, driven by their insatiable need for control. Next, narcissists hate criticism. Narcissists really don't like criticism. They feel like it makes them seem inferior. Even if you just say you don't like something small, like their shirt or a movie, they get upset. Criticizing them makes them mad. They can't handle anyone saying anything negative about them. It's like their feelings get hurt really easily. They might lash out or get defensive when criticized. They want to be seen as perfect and better than everyone else. So, any hint of criticism feels like an attack on them. They'll react strongly, maybe even with anger or aggression. It's hard for them to accept that they're not perfect. Criticism challenges their self-image and makes them feel insecure. They'll do whatever it takes to defend themselves and their ego. Admitting fault or weakness is difficult for them. They'll try to prove you wrong or deflect blame onto someone else. In their eyes, being criticized means they're not as great as they want to believe. Next, narcissists dread losing control. Narcissists really hate losing control. It's one of their biggest fears. They want to be in charge of everything. They try to control what you talk about and even what you do with your life. They want to control every little detail. It's like they don't feel secure unless they're in control. These types of people won't stop until they have total control over you. They might try to control who you see or what you do. Giving up control feels like a threat to them. They'll do whatever it takes to maintain their power over you. It's hard for them to let go and trust others. They want things to go their way all the time. Not being in control makes them anxious and insecure. They'll manipulate situations to regain control. For them, control equals power and security. They don't like feeling vulnerable or uncertain. Losing control means they're not the boss anymore. They'll fight tooth and nail to avoid that feeling. Also, narcissists hate to see others being happy. Narcissists really don't like it when others are happy. They're usually unhappy and insecure themselves. Seeing others happy makes them feel worse about themselves. It's like they can't stand to see anyone else doing well. When they see someone succeeding or reaching goals, it makes them feel even more insecure. They get jealous and upset when others are happy. Their own unhappiness makes them want to bring others down. They might say mean things or try to sabotage others' happiness. 
It's hard for them to feel happy for other people. Their insecurity makes them lash out at others' success. They feel like they should be the ones getting all the attention and praise. When others are happy, it reminds them of what they're missing. They'll do whatever it takes to make themselves feel better, even if it means ruining someone else's happiness. Their own unhappiness consumes them so they can't stand to see others happy. It's like they're always comparing themselves to others and feeling inferior. Narcissists also hate being called out. Narcissists really don't like being called out. If you catch them lying, they get upset. They don't want anyone to know they're lying. It's like they can't handle being wrong. When you point out their lies, they get angry. They might even stop talking to you altogether. Correcting them makes them defensive. They'll argue and try to turn things around on you. It's hard for them to admit they're wrong. They want to seem perfect to everyone. Being called out threatens their image of themselves. They'll do whatever it takes to protect their ego. Admitting fault is difficult for them. They'll deny, deflect, or blame others instead. In their eyes, being called out means they're not as great as they want to believe. They'll lash out to protect their reputation. Their pride is more important to them than being honest. They don't want anyone to see their flaws. Sixth, narcissists hate feeling vulnerable. Narcissists really hate feeling vulnerable. They don't like feeling weak or exposed. If they think others are making fun of them or judging them, they get upset. Being vulnerable makes them feel powerless. Instead of being mean to others directly, they'll find ways to criticize them. They'll pick on everything from their clothes to their hobbies. It's like they want to make others feel bad to cover up their own insecurities. Feeling vulnerable is scary for them. They'll do whatever they can to avoid it. They might act tough or try to put others down to feel better about themselves. Their own insecurities make them lash out at others. They don't want anyone to see their weaknesses. Criticizing others is a way for them to deflect attention away from themselves. It's easier for them to attack others than to deal with their own feelings of vulnerability. They'll try to make others feel small to make themselves feel better. Feeling vulnerable is their worst nightmare. Lastly, stealing the limelight. Narcissists really don't like it when others get attention. They think they deserve all the praise and admiration. If someone else gets recognition, it bothers them. They feel like they should be the center of attention. When a friend or co-worker gets praised, they'll try to make it seem less important. They might say mean things or downplay their achievements. It's like they can't stand to see anyone else being admired. Getting attention makes them feel special. They want everyone to focus on them, not someone else. When someone else steals the spotlight, it makes them jealous. Their own need for attention makes them resentful of others' success. They'll do whatever it takes to bring attention back to themselves. Their ego can't handle someone else being praised. They'll try to undermine others' achievements to make themselves look better. Being in the shadows is their worst nightmare. Dealing with narcissistic people can be a challenge, but understanding their behaviors and triggers can help you navigate those interactions more effectively. If you have any experiences or insights on dealing with narcissistic individuals, please share them in the comments below. Your input can help others who may be struggling in similar 